This game was about one thing for both teams, momentum. Eagle Point, could they sustain their nine-game win streak, or could the Grants Pass Caveman build on their three-game win streak? It got close in the third quarter, coming down to a three-point game, but in the end, it was the Eagles sustaining their win streak. We like being the underdog. That's, that's been our whole motto. We, we want to come into their school and we want to shock them. And I feel like we've done that time and time again this year, so that was our thing. They ended our season last year in the little the COVID playoffs, so we, we were out for vengeance. It wasn't a pretty win by Eagle Point standards, but you can't have a perfect game every time. Sometimes you got to win ugly. The guys really gutted it out, and I told them that in the locker room. They, they went out and earned this W tonight uh, just through sheer perseverance and their attitude. Eagle Point outworked Grant's pass on the boards tonight, taking away the Cavemen's usual path to success. But there's still plenty of season left for GP Boys Basketball and their first-year head coach. A lot of it for us is just being able to be consistent in the things that we do. And, uh, you know, when you play more games as a team, you get more familiarized with my new systems and them getting used to me and all that type of stuff. Eagle Point goes on the road to take on North Eugene Friday evening. And then Saturday afternoon, Grants Pass right back here to host conference foe North Medford.